Hey guys, Conquistador here. So this is my third time trying to make this video. So the first time I almost got through it, then my brother interrupted by saying some funny stuff and I didn't want it to be in the video. Then the second one that I tried, my phone died on me, so hopefully you get through this better now. Okay, so first game we got here, it's a game my uncle talked to me about. He told me it was a pretty good game, so I'm like... I mean, it wasn't rated that great, but I'm like, why not, since it was only 89 cents and it's complete in the box and everything, and that's... Genji Days of the Blade. Yeah, that was only 89 cents and it's like complete. So yeah, and the disc is perfect. Next game we got here, and this one has like a little funny story to it, and I'll tell you what it is. And that's Fantasy Star Universe. So, yeah, it's like a little JRPG. It's actually in really good condition. You can see, really good. And what had happened was they, on, on the GameStop website, and if you scanned it, it came up as $6.29. But thing is, they had it marked on here with for $4.49, so that means that they gave me the wrong price. And so I went back, my brother went back, and he made sure they gave me the money back for it because that was their mistake, not mine. So I got my $1.47 back so I can pick up Genji. So yeah, Fantasy Star Universe. Um, I heard some good things about it. I know that guy, um, lots of games, Jimmy, talked about it. He said it was a really good game. So, yeah. And it's a super cheap game, so I would say pick it up if you could. All right, next game. <clears throat> next games, mind you. Um, this is for GameStop's 4 for 20 deal. So I, I took advantage of that really quickly. And when I paid for them, it wasn't even 4 for 20 since I had the Power Up Rewards card. It came out to $19.55. So yeah. So first game we got here is a game I wanted for a long time. This one's probably the most expensive one I bought. And it's Lollipop Chainsaw. This one was $13.49, but it was $4.49 because of the $4 for 20. Each game is $4.49. So yeah, I'll show you the receipt after. And that game is actually really cool. I didn't expect too much out of it. And it's actually pretty really like pretty fun, honestly. Um Next game is Dead Island Riptide Special Edition. It's not the special edition. It's not even in here because I'm playing it in my 360 currently. It's actually a pretty cool game. Probably better than the first one in my opinion because it makes a lot of the things that were hard in this game a little simpler. Like, you know, crafting weapons and changing around your loadouts and all that's actually pretty easy. Next game we got here is a game I wanted for a while. Also, I wanted Dead Island Riptide for a while, but next game is... Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, you guys know that my copy, which was actually my brother's copy, does not work. So, yeah. So, these games naturally would have been $8.99, $8.99, and this one was $13.49. And the last game is Dead Space, which would have been $8.99. So, I calculated it. I paid $19.55. The games would have all came out to, if they were normal prices, like $40.45, I think. And if I didn't have the Power Up Rewards card at all, they probably would have came out... Like, if I bought them separately, it probably would have came up to, like, almost $50. So this is definitely a good deal. I only picked the expensive games on the 4 for 20. And these are actually really good games that I wanted for a long time. So, yeah. Um, I would say if you do go, don't get the games that are already, like, really cheap because then you're just getting ripped off. But if you get games like this one that are, like, $13 or these $8.99 ones. Or even, um, even, um other games that are like $6.99 you'll still be getting good but I would say try to go for the most expensive ones if you like them because then you get a really good deal that's what I did and I actually really like these too I have all the dead spaces now again um, I have Dead Island 1 and 2 Modern Warfare 2 now I have a complete Call Duties until Black Ops 3 comes out that I'm gonna be behind again Lollipop Chainsaw and Fantasy Star and Genji so some really good pickups so these were 19 and these were like probably like six, like, you know, like six something, six dollars and something cents. So a really good deal. So yeah, thanks guys. Thanks for always coming back. I love you guys and the Conquistador out.